as I said in the previous video, the only reason we use base is because uh, some of the probabilities that we we need to do to complete the decision tree are not given to us, and what's given to us uh, is the opposite of what we what we need for the decision tree. So uh, we are we have four types of probabilities in decision trees. The first one are the pri are called the prior probabilities, which are basically the probability of the states of the world. For example, forty five percent is the probability of national failure. Fifty five percent is the probability of a chance of a national success. Uh, so these are uh, basically uh, this these two are pro called prior probabilities and then we have uh, we do some experiments such as a test market so these are experimental outcomes these events local failure and local success so a second type of probability is uh, experimental probability of experimental outcomes these two and then we have posterior probability probability of national failure given that we had local success so if we have so local success what's the probability of national success so given that we have local success what's the probability of national failure uh, this is called a posterior probability so posterior probabilities are uh, national success given local success national failure given local success national success given local failure national failure given local failure we have these four um, and then we have likelihoods likelihoods are not shown here because uh, they are basically the opposite of what we need here on the decision tree we need posterior probabilities we need these um, but sometimes the opposite of them are given to us for example imagine in the past we have had 55 um, marketing for 55 different products remember this was for chocola uh, one of the products of this company this hypothetical company let's say we have done local marketing and national marketing in the past for 55 other products out of them uh, five of those that were successful so 55 of them were successful uh, out of those 55 that were successful five of them had local failure in the marketing uh, so probability of local failure given national success is given to us so obviously out of 55 success national success 50 of them had local success these two are complements you see that they have the same domain and these are complements local success local failure so this is 1 minus 5 over 55 it's 50 over 55 um, okay so sometimes a lot of times these probabilities are given to us and when I say given it means we can extract this from the data that's available to us and but this is not what we need here we need the posterior probabilities so likelihood is given to us instead of posterior probabilities that's why we need to use base to um, get these probabilities from all this information uh, so usually we have <coughs> these and these and we are looking for uh, these probabilities so we have to calculate these probabilities and these probabilities so in summary uh, we learned the conditional probability we learned the Bayes theorem um, <coughs> and we just learned that we use the Bayes theorem to uh, to to calculate the posterior probabilities when likelihoods are given to us likelihood was uh, probability of p of uh, o given s these these are given to us these are likelihoods and we are looking for these these are posterior probabilities a state of the world given an experimental outcome okay so when we are given a decision tree and we don't have these posterior probabilities we are given the other ones um, we go through three steps to calculate this step one determine the joint probabilities of the form uh, probability of state i and uh, experimental outcome for example p of 
national success and local success p of national success and local failure p of national failure and local success so we calculate these how do we do that uh, we multiply prior probabilities states of the world that are given to us by uh, likelihood okay so we learn that this p of oj given si times p of si gives us joint probability of oj and si so we do that for all of the combinations of the states of the world and experimental outcome um, now that we have all the joint probabilities next we calculate um, probabilities of experimental outcomes p of oj which in in this case in this example is probability of local success and local failure by adding up the individual um, joint probabilities that include oj so for example out of everything that we calculated here the, if you look if you are calculating probability of local success i look at all the joint probabilities that have uh, local success um, so here it's going to be for this one um, probability of local success is probability of local success joint probability of local success and national success plus p of local success and national failure and this one probability of local failure i pick the ones that have local failure in them p of local failure and national success plus p of local failure and national failure okay that was a step two so a step two the focus was on these experimental outcomes in a step three last step um, let me clean these in the last step now that we have all the joint probabilities and these guys uh, experimental outcomes determine each posterior probability p of s given oj for example P of national success if we have local success by dividing the joint probability P of national success and local success we calculated this in a step one over P of this goes here local success and this was an experimental outcome we calculated that in step two then we get all of these values national success national failure uh, so that is for example p of national failure given that because it comes from this path and here we have local success given that we have local success okay so we go through these three steps to get posterior probabilities but note that sometimes posterior probabilities are already given to us such as the such as this example in front of us or the ones that uh, we solve before learning about base so it doesn't mean that we always have to do all of these things we do it only if these posterior probabilities aren't given to us